All right, what's good YouTube, it's Jay here. Honestly, don't have a really fancy intro for today's video. I've been up all night playing Helldivers. That game was a ton of fun. Running into a bit of a bad issue though, where people can apparently just kick you for free, which is a ridiculous. Obviously, there's always gonna be some guy out there trying to ruin the game for everybody. It really honestly sucks like a lot. But either way, we're over here on Call of Duty. Uh, we're testing out the new chainsaw attachment. I've seen everybody and their grandmother make videos on this all day, but I was so busy with work. And then when I got off of work, I wanted to stream Helldivers. So I didn't get a chance to actually play around with it. There is now a chainsaw for your guns. Specifically, I think you can put it only on like AR shotguns and battle rifles and stuff. You can't put it on subs. But yeah, here it is right here. You can also charge it up and just straight up walk into people with it going. I haven't tested this out yet, but I heard you can get hit markers with it. So we're gonna go ahead and hop into some small map mosh pit and just see how it feels, because this looks like a ton of fun. By the way, the, the weekly like challenges are pretty easy. I mean, you gotta just get operator kills with certain ammo types, under barrel types, throwing knives, point blanks, and melee kills. And you can actually do the lethal under barrel attachment um, in tandem with the point blank kills if you use the shotgun under barrel. It all works the same, so. I think I'm gonna need to build like a really, really fast class for this though. So we're gonna put on this, we're gonna put on lightweight. We're gonna have the ninja perk equipped with the uh, vest. I don't wanna play on meat though. I wanna play on like shipment or stash house or something. We've also got a snipers only playlist and we've got a horror point hellhound like variant of a uh, horror point. You got departures 24 seven. I really wanna check that map out again because that video that I posted the other day with me using the striker nine had to be one of the most insane like games I've ever had in my life, dude. Apparently optic gaming is suing Activision. Apparently they're suing them for damages and uh, I don't even know. I have to read over the whole article, but apparently Optic Gaming and Hex, Skump, they're suing Activision for their poor management of the CDL for basically all the money they've taken for their 100% monopoly over the CDL and its decisions. And I'm happy. I want to see the CDL fail. I want to see it collapse. It does not need to live at all. It's been a terrible system for the last few years, and I'm praying on this downfall. <laughs> I'm praying that whatever they do, this lawsuit, I pray that it works. <laughs> you mad, buddy. Yo, Ampu, you want me to sniff you? Hmm? I give it a if you put it on uh like the actual like underbarrel, you can't actually like melee with it. Oh my god. <laughs> I highly doubt this is gonna be as good as I would like it to be. Oh that's right, I can't I gotta remember that. Alright, so yeah, you cannot melee with this thing if you have it in like a shotgun mode or whatever. But it's a lot harder just to run up on people with the thing wrapped up. Like that's a little niche. It's more of a niche way of kind of going about it, more gimmicky. Like if you just want to have fun and be stupid. But yeah, like that right there, you, you can't really do anything, you know? Okay, so we're just gonna try just swinging at people with it. I can find anybody. Oh, they're just try harding so hard though, man. All the jump shotting going crazy. There's no fun in this game. There's no fun allowed at all. There's somebody over here. I swear there's somebody over here. Come here. Like it doesn't even look like you're meleeing with the chainsaw. Wait, let me see. No, dude. All right, so I want to get a couple of kills with it like this. <laughs> it just turns up into chunks of meat. Oh my God. <laughs> this is so stupid. <laughs> This is actually one of the most fun things I think they've ever added. We're basically playing Gears of War right now. Come here, let's take throwing knives off. Yeah, because I'm just stabbing. All right, yeah, we'll take those off 100%. All right, so let's take the throwing knives off. There we go. There we go. No, dude. Why is it that when you mantle, you can't like melee? That's just so stupid to me. Come here. Oh my God. It turned him into blood chunks, dude. I really like when they add stupid fun stuff like this, you know? This is truly what makes the game just a lot more fun. Come here. Oh my god. Just let me get up in your face really quick. I just want to mm, mm, There we go There we go, man, dude, this Call of Duty is such a W in my opinion I hate Activision with the passion of a thousand suns, but this game is an absolute colossal W. Come here It's a W man. Every update's fun. The guns are fun. The attachments are fun These little conversion kits they keep doing are fun Obviously the game has some issues like when it, when certain updates go out There are a ton of problems with certain parts of it, but for the most part I would say it's it's been relatively smooth I, I know I just kind of contradicted myself right there But it is true like a majority of the updates have been pretty smooth from my experience I do think that there are some issues with the game's frame rate and just randomly dropping here and there with every update uh, aside from that though Like I think the content updates that we've been getting have been some of the best ones We've gotten probably since like bo4 bo3 in my opinion Come here. Oh my god <laughs> Let's try to shut that turret down in the back. They got a cruise missile coming in. I don't want to get hit by that. Come here. 
I actually got like a quad or I, I didn't get a quad feed I don't think I wonder what the reactions are like when they hear that like revving honestly I find this a lot more entertaining than um the chainsaw like melee weapon skin that we got before i think this being its own independent thing is a lot more fun than just being a reskin of a certain piece of equipment or whatever because it actually feels like a chainsaw this time around i'm coming for this guy i'm coming for you i'm coming for you where are you <laughs> this is such a fun piece of gear dude holy cow there's a guy with a knife so one thing that sucks about these small maps though everybody goes so hard on those sometimes like you got to really amp up your game you gotta really amp up your gameplay if you actually wanna like have fun on these kind of maps, man. Like you gotta really be cracked out of your mind sometimes. <laughs> the chainsaw is insane, dude. Oh, oh, this is about to be so chaotic, dude. Shipment. Here we go. Let's throw some smokes out. I wish I had two pieces of equipment on. Two smoke grenades. Oh my god, are you for real? I'm, I gotta put thermites on. Dude, there's always that guy. There's always that guy. Get out of here. Some stupid riot shields. Riot shields, in my opinion, should have like a way to just break them after a while, especially in like war zone and stuff. I remember making it to like a couple of final circles and I just ran into a guy with a riot shield. There was just nothing I could do about it. You know why? Because he had an impenetrable shield on his back. And once he once he stunned me, he just beat me to death. Like I tried to outmaneuver him for so long. I did my best. And then the worst part was he was in a stack of people with him. Like, look, at, dude, like, come on, man. Like, I generally could go another Call of Duty without having riot shields in it. We didn't have them in Cold War, and that game was phenomenal. We had them in BO2. They weren't as, like I say. Get out of here, dude. Like, come on, man. Get out of here. I just hate the mechanic, man. It's just not a fun one. It's just annoying to run into. Come here. Like, look at that. They're just trying so hard to survive. Like, get out of here. <laughs> I'm trying to match my thumbstick and break it on my $200 controller. Okay, I'm going to call in the smoke drone really quick. Just pop it in the middle, I guess. Come here. No, no, no. How do I miss? Get out of here. Like, why is everybody, why is everybody in their grandmother using a riot shield, dude? I know it's to stay alive, but I don't think that nerf that they gave it was enough. It needs to be way stricter with its like damage mitigation or whatever. I, I need to just leave this lobby. That's what I, that's what I'm going to do. Chainsaw's a lot of fun and riot shields ruin the game. Activision, you suck.